everyone, Sigler here, Bork, Chef, you can call me whatever you'd like. So, we actually hit 400 subscribers. Jesus Christ, I did not expect this at all. Like, it is insane. Oh. I, like, it's, it's, it's very fun to see. And I, like I said, I didn't expect it at all. I mean, if we go into the analytics... And uh, I think it's, it, yeah, it's this, right? Is it? Mm. I think you should be able to make it like longer. But yeah, like when I started again, well, I, I've been on and off like for multiple years. I think, when did I post my, like my first video? Yeah, as you can see, 2013. Like, sure, it wasn't like I did had like a, like, oh, this is uh, gonna be gonna focus on this and stuff like that. No, like, not really. I was just posting crap. Like, it the, the, it was so much random shit. But I actually like. I I, f I feel like I went a little bit a little bit more serious again in uh over here yeah like this is the pretty much the first video when i was like well let me try it and it it actually got 761 views so it's fun and yeah um it's just fun to see to see what happened and when i started again at this point at this video I had uh, we were <laughs> it, it sounds so wrong when I say that I had like I don't own any one of you uh, like we are like when uh, when I started again we were about like 173 like we were below 200 subscribers I know that for for sure but yeah it's been very fun and like a lot of people are asking me like why why don't you edit them like why don't you script them and and things like that and the the thing is like i prefer to do it like one take because i first of all i don't have that much time to play and i prioritize other things but i still want to do this and I don't want I don't want to script it because uh, if I script it I have to like learn like text and I don't want to sit like this and reading of a script and just oh, da, 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 da. that that's just me I just want to speak from my heart and about a topic and if the video sucks it sucks I cannot do that much about it and the edit just takes too long and yeah I rather do something else I rather actually play the game even more to make more videos during the time you have to edit so yeah but we are 400 subscribers and i thought i'm gonna like talk about why i prefer to play a tank and i have played this game since my cousin will probably correct me if he ever sees this because i said says like wrong every time but I'm pretty sure I dinged level 70 on my Dwarf Hunter in... I, I think I had played it like a little bit on and off and tried it like earlier. But I think it was when Samuel Plateau uh, was released because I remember that I dinged 70 and I tried to do the dailies like on the first day. I remember that. And... I think that was like in 2007, I think, 2006, 2007, around there. And I remember that I started doing dungeons and everything. And I remembered, because Hunter was so easy, and it was a class that my cousin recommended to me. And it, it looks fun. But I remembered from a lot of dungeons that, like, the the tank like th sometimes they were like 
these tanks that could keep aggro all the fucking time, like never lose the aggro at all. And other times they kept aggro like it was nothing. And I remember that I thought like, why, why, why are they not pulling more? Like this is perfectly fine. And it's like, oh, like just pull these and then we wait for like five minutes before the next pull and then we go and we do that one and I, w I was always like this is actually kind of slow like no like it, it's nothing wrong with taking it a little bit more, bit more like piano if we should call it that but yeah and there's uh, also another reason why I uh, in because when we got the when we got Lich King, we actually got the refer a friend, which made it so like you can you could link your account with with another account, so you get like I, I think it was like fifty percent exp or like maybe double the exp that you got normally, and yeah, there was a like wonky like level up system that like once you leveled it you could grant the other player level levels so we love me and my cousin leveled up like pretty quickly and during the times when i played uh, in uh, tbc there was a specific person that made me like really want to play especially paladin but a tank because his videos was like very inspirational for me and they still are and he's r the reason why I love to boost people for free with this type of way and I'm pretty sure that everybody knows who this is Seventeen years ago. So I basically get all the good loot and they get all the good experience. Yeah. So Wow Hobbs has actually been like one of my Yeah, he's been a huge inspirational for me since like ever since T B C and onwards. Um I don't uh, watch him that much anymore because he plays a lot of Hearthstone, but I join him from time to time and just watch but the way that he played was so nice and it was different back then and yeah th like the mindset to just help people and everything was so nice and i just yeah my goal and mindset uh, like from lich from lich king when i leveled my paladin to level 80 and did next ramas and all of that has been like how can i play to just keep going pretty much and like utilize my cooldowns a little bit more efficiently and 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 yeah just everything and I just feel like it's like if you're DPS, sure it's it can be fun to do that as well. Like, but you 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 have to like focus on the numbers. For me personally, it's like I, alongside with the healer, of course, has to like. Um, it feels like a dance, pretty much like the more you pull and everything the more like you need to just wave w with your with your whenever you're like dancing and depending on how much you pull and everything the more sway it can get and if you're not using your cooldowns properly you're gonna fall over that that is a li little bit like a weird way to see it maybe but that's just the way that i see it and yeah and and then 
I just find it very interesting to tank. I don't know why, but it just is. And it feels more fun to gear towards it because it's like, no, it feels like, sure, you can have a bis gear and everything. And depending on the expansion, like it depends on like what stats is they prioritized and everything. But there are so many different kind of ways that you can play as a tank. Because as a DPS, it's like this gear piece is the best one. Because you're going to make the mo most possible damage with it. And that's it. But as a tank, you can have like a damage, a damage gear. You can have a threat gear. You can have a like a mitigation gear. You can have like there's so much gear and everything that you can do and so many different play styles that you can play. Sure, with that DPS, you can do different kind of specs. And later on, you can do like different, like currently in Dragonflight, for example, there is multiple way that you can play it depending on how you want to play it. But yeah. And once we got the, there's another reason why I, like I really enjoy classic and I really enjoy looking for a group and like running towards a dungeon and everything. But I'm sorry, like ever since we got looking for a dungeon and we got teleported to the dungeon, it's very hard to not wanna play a tank when you are pretty much used to this. Like, okay, let me show you. I'm here on my warrior that is uh, 82 and a half. But like, look at this. If I press fine now, see, it's instant. It's like instant. So yeah. So that, that is like one, the, one of the reasons why it's very fun to play and everything. And I just wanted to, whenever I'm tanking, I, I'm, like it, tanking for me is another reason why I really like to have all my good, well, not good, but like all the macros that I use to make the tank feel a bit more simpler. Because whenever I play a tank, sure, you can optimize for different kind of gears and everything, but I want to have like more awareness to what is happening around me rather than having to look at an a action bar. Sure, you can learn the actual rotation properly, the actual rotation that you should do like in your mind. But when I'm playing, I want to have my mind all cleared to like, what is my health? What is my healer's mana? Is something spawning? Is there a new mechanic? Is there a like a mechanic that is coming? And yeah, uh, it's that's just the way that I feel like I want to do it because also I remember back in the day, I, it was like, this is taking so long, like I said, and when I play the DPS and I feel like there's a lot of other people that is like watching this, if they play DPS, they want to have more speed and they want to like get in, get done, get out pretty much like get in, get it done, get out. That is what, like our main purpose and get the gear. So, and who is the one dragging the group, like making it move forward, who is setting the pace? That is actually the tank. Well, sure, you can have like a hunter or something like ninja pulling. But yeah, like whenever I'm tanking, I'm I'm actually incentivized. Uh, I think you call like I like I'm motivating rogues and hunters if they have misdirect or the um trick of the trades i'm like you feel free to use it like just mind my health and use it use it as much as possible because i will just use some cooldowns and i will save cooldowns if that happens and yeah just we, we just want to get it done to have like have it cleared and everything so yeah, it, it, it's, I hope this is like explaining enough for you, for everyone, like my way that to really enjoy playing tank 
and like I've said multiple times, I played like every single tank, every expansion. Um, sure, I haven't played in like the original classic vanilla like era. All the tanks I have not. I have played a druid tank. That is the only one. So I am not like one of those who can. I, like I have no saying in the in uh, classic. But from TBC forward, I played every single tank, every single expansion. So, yeah, I I really enjoy it. And I, so occasionally, I do actually play healer. But it's pretty much just to have a feel that... Um, just to learn what the healer is going through by healing the tank just to learn like okay if he does that this is how it feels for them like the panic and everything and yeah it it, it feels like it's actually kind of good to know a little bit about that as well but yeah we are 400 subscribers like i told uh, at the start this is insane uh, to me and we are we are closing in on the actual like the first membership thing which is insane i never expected this but you never know it would be fun to reach the 500 and onward but it's nothing i'm expecting like usual like i'm just gonna keep posting and yeah i i i'm just posting everything that i like that i personally want to post and I just hope that it can help people. And if it doesn't, like, if if you feel like nothing of my content is helping you anymore, like, you're free to leave. I'm sorry. I hope that you don't. But if, if, uh, if I've helped with just one tip or one video, I'm very satisfied with that. And, yeah. Um, if you click on this video, it's gonna be a video uh, that is you that YouTube actually feels like this is uh, the best video for you to watch, watch from me. And uh, yeah, thanks everyone for the incredible support. And I'll see you next in. I'll like always. I can't even speak. <laughs> Remember to click subscribe and like this page if it's helping you. And click this video, and I'll see you over there. Bork bork.